Hello guys, guys, and welcome back to another episode of the World SMP. Uh, guys, this is episode 3 of the World SMP, and I've got some exciting stuff to show you guys right off the bat. But anyways, oh my god. <laughs> okay, well, I guess I kind of just gave away the surprise there. I had to flip my screen around. But anyways, welcome to World SMP, guys. Um, as you guys might notice, there's something really cool that I put in here. Yes, I have taken the time, and I put railways going to my house, spawn, and I plan to be extending it out here to go to the rest stop and Styles' house and all other stuff. So, uh, pretty much my goal um probably by the end of the smp is to make sure that railroads connect everything in here so we don't have to waste time walking or running around and wasting food um and we we can just get stuff done so that is why i did that but anyways i've got more exciting stuff to show you guys besides just this so i'll go ahead and use my own railway here um so basically there's this little passage here and then um this railroad or railway will take us all the way oh no Okay, I thought though it goes just fast enough to where if you run into a creeper it won't blow up. So I'm very thankful for that. Um but anyways, yeah, I got to the point where it's just taking too long to get up to my house, so I thought I'd just make this railway to make things nice and simple. And, uh, you know, truth be told, it, it I get to my house in, like, maybe 45 seconds tops, and I don't have to touch anything. It just takes me where I need to go, so I think it's awesome. And I have, like, these little terminals and stuff, and I guess... Um, by the end of the SMP, everyone will just have their own minecart that they keep in their uh, inventory and stuff. Because I don't want to put chests with minecarts there. That's too much trouble. It just everyone should be able to hold on to their own minecart. It only costs like um, five uh, iron ingots, so I don't think it's that expensive. Um, farm hasn't really changed that much, but I've done a lot with the house. You guys will see in just a second. So I changed the outside to clean stone as per request of a few people. Um, I think it looks. I think it looks a lot nicer. I had to replace this um, because the cobblestone with polished. Uh, polished andesite and, and, and granite uh, or yeah it didn't really look all that great together so I changed that to stone bricks right here and then I changed that, uh, these two to polished versions of what they were before and if you step in here I've made some pressure plates I've put in a floor and I have like a little archway that kind of makes it look nice my furnace is right there I have two anvils uh, just in case one runs out I actually made a one while I was in a mine so because um, I didn't have my actual anvil with me so I just brought it back home and now I have two so I might even want to take that with me it's just if I'm on the run or actually you know what whatever we'll just leave it here and uh, you know I got some furnaces and all that cool stuff I also have a lot of <laughs> bone meal and arrows we'll get to that in the in the second clip here but I just want to um, show you around here first and um, as you guys might notice there's staircases going down and the staircases going up I'll go down first so I can save like the upstairs for for last um, so downstairs that's not quite finished uh there's still a lot of work to do but i put all my chests here and i've kind of gone uh, about organizing everything this is the only chest that i haven't used because i couldn't really think of a section to label it so that'll just be open until i find something uh useful to put in there but anyways i have my farming up here i have lots of potatoes because food is a problem i make sure to stockpile that i have some wood some saplings uh, some sugar some paper some water i already have some in my inventory though lots of bone meal sugar can all that cool stuff and um, down here we have our valuables so i did go mining i have a block of diamond and six spare i have efficiency protection projectile protection i also have uh, some blocks of iron a lot of blocks of iron because you know stockpile why not um some gold mm, a little bit lacking on the gold because i had to make powered rails for the railway so i had to use a lot of my own gold for that um uh, so hopefully uh maybe i'll put up some like donate um chests next to the rail the the railway to have people donate if they actually enjoy using the railway because i actually did waste a lot of resources on that so i don't know maybe i'll put a donate box or something next to it so people know that <laughs> i did put a lot of work into it so maybe you should consider donating to it um but anyways lapis lazuli i'll just use that for enchanting and stuff which i'll definitely get to later this episode i have 43 levels so i'm just gonna go ham on those level 30 enchantments since they only take away three levels when you do a level 30 enchantment now so um i should be able to get at least one two three four five 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 or so level 30 enchantments i don't know my math's all off point because i'm recording and i'm not really thinking about math right now um but yeah anyways that's that so i'm gonna get to enchanting all my gear later this episode i'm not gonna waste time doing that now um so that's all my valuables for now uh, i have utility blocks uh signs railways and stuff like that i have some leftover railways so all i need is powered rails from here on out um 
I found like an abandoned mine shaft and I just took all the rails from it. I didn't actually craft all those. So um, I just have some leftover stuff, um, some protection one stuff that I'm not using. Right now I'm just using regular iron armor because uh, the stuff I really want to enchant is my diamond armor when I get enough diamonds to make it. So I'm waiting off on that and you know, just a power one bow, but I have a power four bow right here. And uh, I have a really nice pickaxe and I have a kind of okay sword, but I'm hoping to make those a lot better when I do my enchanting session later in this episode. So um, yeah, brewing or or, sorry, brewing's over here. Uh, instant health, I got that from a witch. All my decoration blocks, all my regular blocks, all my miscellaneous stuff, and this chest has been undecided. So I've, I have a lot of stuff so far, and I'm looking to expand that, maybe get some more diamonds later in this episode and all that cool stuff. Uh, up here, I have a fireplace. I have a little, um, <laughs> a little, like, a little couch area where you can sit and watch TV and stuff. Kind of click those buttons click those buttons I don't know <laughs> play video games and over here I have a computer uh, it's kind of a fail of a computer but I can sit and play Minecraft and stuff so you know it is what it is <laughs> and over here I just kind of have a desk I guess it's kind of like a, a pen or something I don't know I just kind of put it there Maybe I can just sit around and flip switches all days maybe that's my work um, <laughs> who knows what my work is nowadays but yeah that's pretty much the house and that's the railway that's all the aesthetic stuff that I've done off camera hopefully you guys like it tell me what you think tell me what you I should add because I have a lot of space I have a lot of space down here, and I don't know what to put there. I do have an enchanting table, but I just mainly use the enchanting table down at the rest stop anyways, so I don't I don't think I need an enchantment table in here. But I mean, I could make a little enchanting area, but I just need to know what to do with those open space. And I guess you guys can go ham with those suggestions down in the comment section below, because I have no idea what to put there. Maybe I'll just make it like a, like a, I don't know, like a, a hangout area. No, I don't want hangout area in my chest room. I don't know what to put there. It would have to be something practical that would go with my chest room room i don't know you guys are creative so i'll let you guys figure that out but anyways i'm gonna go ahead and ride this railway down and i will see you in a clip with i did with joey and uh basically we revamp a little skeleton spawner that we found which would explain all the arrows and bone meal that i've been having so i'll get to that clip and then afterwards i will go ahead and maybe show a little bit of mining and i will do my enchanting session where i show you guys just what i um am able to pull off with these enchantments i don't know i haven't done it yet so I'm excited to see what enchantments I get. Alright guys, so we're down here with the skeleton spawner. Me and Joey, or Joey and I, we're just we're just gonna do some tender loving on this thing because uh yep. you I didn't yeah, I didn't show you guys when we first came down here, but it was uh it was rather bad. I like the uh, word you use right there, tender. <laughs> it needs some tender care. Well, I mean look at this thing, it does. Okay, when we got down here, it was just literally Wait. like a Wait, 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 wait. By the way, of... if you guys don't know what this is, is a skeleton spawn. Why did they stop spawning? I don't is know. Maybe they just they just we, they just felt like we, we needed some time to just make this place look better. Uh, because when we got in here, it was just like this room was not cleared at all. Um, and I don't know, just it, it was needed pitiful, some dude. some work. So it needs a lot of work, and I'm gonna a lot, probably do a, a lot, lot of, of work in this video. It probably gonna be a lot of cuts or maybe just a speed up at some point, but I don't know. We just kind of wanted to do our thing and I don't know if there's some How good about, clips in yeah. here. We'll, we'll stick them in. We'll stick them in just like that. You know? So basically what I'm thinking is an idea is because I have a bunch of signs right here. Now, basically these chests right here will be bows and then make a, these will be bows and then right hmm. here will be arrows. You know, you, you see what I'm doing here? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Obviously, we're going to get more chests. We're going to need a lot more birch wool. Wait, what the hell do I do? Some. I've got some, yeah. I'll Wait, make some chests. I... Oh, that's weird. Okay, I, I placed that weird. Hold up. I meant to place these back uh, back here. It's going to be a lot of thinking in this episode. I'm not really going to be talking. Yeah, just a lot of design stuff going on. And it's um, kind of sad because I did this the past like three world videos, but whatever, YOLO. <laughs> Uh, bows that way, uh, arrows that way. Okay, cool. And I might want to do some hopper magic, um, just so to save us time, I guess, mm -hmm. with collecting it all and organizing it. But here, just to show you the rest of it, um, here, if we go up here. Oh, yeah. I haven't actually not seen. Up, if we come all the way back up here, basically what people would do is where they AFK, they AFK, like, right up here. And, he, like, they would go and this right is where the room is? Like they would go right, yeah. Basically, like I don't have a shovel on me, but it's like, oh, watch out! <laughs> I have a shovel. It's, bas yeah. it's basically like people would just sit right there, block themselves right there, block themselves in, and then just go AFK. Okay, and I'm guessing it's right through this wall. 
No? Okay. Yeah, no, it is. Actually, I need to show you how it works if you want to. Yeah, talk. show because like I, I know some pretty optimal ways to make like the uh, the spawning pads. There you go. Oh, okay. Um. I mean, it looks it looks like it's working fine. Yeah. Right. Okay. Cool. Um. Let me actually. I, I don't think there's really any better way to optimize it to be honest. No, I, I was thinking something else, but yeah, that no, that works. Yeah, that that, that works pretty well. Got sand right there. Okay, cool, cool. I don't understand why the barricade's in the middle, but whatever. That's basically how it works. Um, I don't know. I guess to kind oh, of like... Oh, that's weird. Now they're spawning. That's so weird. Well, it's because we're right here. Yeah, but like, it's it sucks how you have to be all the way up here in order for them to spawn. You can't be yeah. all the way down there for them to spawn. I don't know. It's kind of a weird thing. Maybe it's like a, a tag team type thing. Like someone stands up here, some person goes down there. I don't know. But all yeah, right. that's how the spawner works. That's so we might we just want to leave this open so people can just walk right in and, you know, AFK there. Yeah, well, obviously we're going to have to, like, spice it up, dude. It was kind of janky to get in there. Yeah, we're going to have to revamp this. Because, look, this this is what it was before. It was just, like, really awkward. And it still is kind of awkward, so we need to fix it. Oh! <laughs> dude, we didn't have a bottom on this. I forgot. I got rid of it. Nice. All right. So uh, here, okay, I'm going to go down here, and I'm going to start opening this up a little bit. All right, sounds good. It's just like if you run out, it's like, oh no! Yeah, I have to keep an eye on my uh, my wood supply. Although we should be fine. You gave me a lot of wood. I just keep stocking it up. I'm down to like my last two stacks. I'm telling you, we should make that wood shop. You should make a wood shop. I already got a successful shop, and I'm probably going to make another one that a lot of people are going to buy from. True. I need to make something simple. I like how I was telling you, like, oh, make a simple shop that's really easy and that people will need. I go and make, like, this friggin' weird shop. <laughs> that's, like, uh, wicked complicated. No, 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 don't make the roof uh, wood. Don't make the roof wood. I got an idea. Nice. That that's like very big and open. Yeah, because look yeah. at this. Now it's like you drop you, you drop in and then it's like what? Hmm. Ah! <laughs> uh, yeah. Hold on. I don't know, man. I don't know. I got. I'm flipping out right now. No, I got an idea. Screw all this shenanigans. Just make a floating half slab right there. No. <laughs> Actually, would that work? Yeah. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> hey, you know what? No, no, that that yeah, that actually works a lot better in my opinion. Or maybe even a full block. Nah. nah, 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 nah. <laughs> yeah, that's but, like low but, profile. You can walk under it. Yeah. <laughs> Fill that up. Oh, eh, I just grabbed some water though. Okay, it's cool. I need to refill my water bucket, anyways. <laughs> that block. Oh no, that cobblestone. It's gonna. It's gonna. Oh my god, that's it's, killing my OCD. It'll despawn. No, no, the poor lost cobble. No. I'm going for Save it. Save him, Joey. Save him. Save the cobble. Did I pick it up? Here we see a father trying to save his son, which was successful. Get out of there, man! <laughs> All right. The cobble was saved. Joey saved the day! Oh my god! They killed Kenny! You bet! Oh, we could actually mimic the same <laughs> idea right here. Look. Is ready? Right. We can mimic the same idea. You wanna know how? Bang, bang, bang. Bang, bang, Bosh. Nice. We just gotta put some water behind there. Hello. <laughs> All right. Huh. Hello. Well. My name is Ender Archer. <laughs> I haven't oh talked God. to Gleb in so long. I haven't talked to him in like a solid year. Yeah, exactly. Same. 
Like, did he? I think die? he kind of dropped off the face of the earth. No, I just haven't talked to him. I haven't talked to, him. to Mr. Minecraft in a while too. But like, oh I mean, my god, that was the perfect amount. No, I've talked to I've talked to Red. Yeah, I've talked to Matt. There. <laughs> no Bodycraft series rip for me and him though. <laughs> I know. He didn't even. He had the chance to record though. I I just kept bl blue screening every five seconds. <laughs> oh, it was awful. It was pitiful. Hold on, I'm gonna try something. <sighs> now it actually looks like legit supports. Yeah, this literally looks like someone's house. This. <laughs> this it does. Literally looks like a house. It so does. Like all right guys welcome to the end clip of the video um guys i'm excited we're gonna do some enchanting i've got something crazy like 49 levels i'm gonna try to get 50 off of some of the stuff i'm smelting i did some mining and i got a lot of stuff i did some insane strip mining i found some pretty big caves and stuff uh, i might want to live stream that in the future because it was a it was a big exciting cave so i didn't want to record it because i don't want to make this like a mining episode or anything no one really wants to watch a full episode of mining but uh live streaming maybe i don't know just tell me your opinion i uh, if i did do live streaming of something like mining i'd probably put it on twitch because if i do it on youtube then it just puts it as a video afterwards and i'm I, i'm not really sure i want like an hour long video of me just mining as a video so um yeah let me know what you guys think of that but anyways i'm gonna try to get 50 levels off of just picking up some of the stuff i got an insane amount of iron and an insane amount of coal um and this isn't even all my coal i have some more coal stashed away so it's a lot. It's a lot. I'm thinking about doing an under the table trade with Joey um, because he owns the coal shop. Uh, I'll trade him some coal for something in exchange. But uh, I, I've been playing a little bit hard to get not to drive the price up just because I want to be sure that I have enough coal after selling it to him because I don't want to sell him all my coal and then be like, oh, crap, I need coal and then buy coal from him. That doesn't make sense at all. Um, but anyways, we are le level 50. Um, we could try to get the level 51 real quick before we do this enchanting, but I don't really think it's that important. Let's just go ahead and do, I don't know, this is probably going to get us a lot of uh, books of enchanting. I've got uh, 50, uh, 63 books here. We can probably do 50 down to 47. That's one down to 44. That's two down to a 41 that's three it's a lot of level 30 enchanting let's just let's just say that let's just say that uh, i don't like i said earlier i don't want to do math on on my my day where i'm just trying to play some world smp no nah, no nah, i'm not doing any of that so anyways i'm gonna go ahead and make this into a block and just go ahead and get on our way we got our 50 levels i'm very very happy um this guy is being a rascal he's he like he he hit me once and tried to run away i don't <laughs> i don't get what that is okay well anyways let's go ahead and use our nice rail cart system to get all the way down there um it's a little bit loud but i'll be sure to turn that down in post i'm sure and uh i really love it i really i really do love it because it just makes things so so much easier the only thing i don't like is like spiders and creepers and skeletons hang out around here so i usually get like um, bombarded by them so I'm going to try my best to kind of light this area up as I go along here. Um, and that should do the trick. All right, time to use Joey's rest stop to go ahead and get some enchanting done. Oh, guys, you have no idea. I've, I've been I've been waiting and waiting and waiting to do this. You guys have no idea. All right, so I'm going to enchant books, not my actual tools, um, just to be sure that, uh, you know, I can get the full spectrum here. And hopefully I don't get repeat stuff, but you never know. You never know. Uh, it's, it's the risk we take, so... What I think I'm going to do is I want to make some armor, some diamond armor, but I'm going to enchant some books and see if I get some good uh, prot, prot stats, uh, protection stats. So I'm going to go ahead and do this. We got tons of lapis lazuli, so that's not even a problem. Efficiency three. Efficiency four on there, so I'm not, I'm not sure about that. Mm, all right, let's try it. Oh, buddy boy. Fire protection three. That's pretty nice. We got sharpness three. I could put sharpness three on there. That would that would be rather nice. Sharpness three. Uh, you know what I could do? If I get another sharpness two book, I'll combine the sharpness two book onto my diamond sword. Have two sharp threes. Combine the sharp threes, get a sharp four. Okay, that would be nice. That would be nice. Knockback two. Oh, I've already got a knockback two. I can make it knockback three. Oh, it's just knockback. That is a stinky one. That is a stinky one, guys. We just stunk up the place with our knockback. Well, I mean, now I can have knockback three and just annoy the annoy the piss out of everyone. <laughs> um, okay. Um, let's go ahead and try it once more. Oh, baby. Okay, so here's what we can do. If we get a sharpness two, we'll combine it with this one. 
the sword, the sword right there. We'll, we'll combine, that'll make it sharpness 3 sword. We'll combine the sharpness 3 sword with the sharpness 3 book. We'll get sharpness 4. Then we'll get sharpness 4 book. We'll get sharpness 5. It's like a whole ladder of systems, but oh my gosh, it'll power 4. If we get another power 4, we'll be able to level up our bow to power 5. Oh, dude, I'm loving this. I'm loving this so much. Infinity. Oh, we're getting so lucky. We're getting so lucky. I love it. I l oh my gosh, guys. I'm... I cannot convey how excited I am right now. We're gonna have a power five bow. We're gonna have a sharpness five. Hold on, hold on, sharpness. We're gonna have a sharpness five sword and efficiency. Do we have efficiency? Efficiency three, efficiency four. Okay, we can't do anything with efficiency. Dude, we're gonna have some pretty gnarly weapons. We're gonna have some pretty gnarly weapons. Efficiency three again. We'll combine those two efficiency three books. Oh no, I can I can choose between efficiency and sharpness. I'm gonna choose the I'm gonna choose the sharpness because the sharpness five on the sword would be OP as heck. Um okay. I don't really need it at this point. Unbreaking. Hmm. I don't need another sharpness. I can sell it. I can sell it to be honest. Alright guys, so that's it. Let's go ahead and take a look back at what we got here. I'm gonna go ahead and lay it out here. Actually, uh, do I want to go back and do the, do the, oh no, I need a sharpness two. Let me see if I can get a sharpness two real quick from a level two trade. All right. So I don't need you. Let's try to get a sharpness two. Let's try to get sharpness two. Fortune. That would be nice. Efficiency. Let's try to get sharp. Oh, my phone is ringing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh no. Okay. We're in a tight spot now. We are in definite tight spot. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. I don't want that. I don't want that. Let's try once more. This will be my last go at it, guys. This is going to be my last go at it. Ready? Let's, uh, feather falling. All right. Let's not go for it. All right. So that is our... That is our pull here. I'm gonna see if I can snag uh, sharpness two off of anyone else on the server. Maybe they'll have sharpness two. Maybe I have sharpness two in one of my chests at home. I don't know. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I will do some com uh, combining of the enchantments to get some insane gear in the beginning of next episode. So I'll make sure to go ahead and do that. And uh, I think this is where I sign out. We pulled some pretty good stuff here. Efficiency. This one was a good book. This one was a definitely good book. Um, and we also got some knockback. Infinity. Power. We can do the power four right now. You know what? I'm going to do the power right now. I'm going to go ahead and combine my power onto this bow right now. So just so we can have an insane bow. So I'll go ahead and do this little bit as kind of a nice thing for the end of the episode here. And then we'll do some sharpness upgrades on my sword in the beginning of next episode. And then armor, um, I'm going to worry about armor later in a future episode, but I, I kind of want to do enchantments at the end of each episode because it's a nice way to kind of end it off on a happy note and it leaves you something to look forward to at the end of each episode. So I think that was a good idea on my part and we should continue with it. Let me know what you guys think, but I think I want to do like, I'll, I'll probably get up to level 50 uh, before each episode starts and I'll, I'll do like that amount of enchanting at the end just to kind of leave like a little bit of mystery uh, for each episode. So. Anyways, let's go ahead and make our powerful bow. <laughs> no pun intended. And our infinite infinite bow. Our in infinite in, in infinite bow. Oh, it's gonna take so many levels though. Oh no. Okay. Well, let's do it. Whatever. Let's do it. it it's time. Oh! <sighs> Snapperino. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on, come on, give me stuff, give me stuff, give me stuff, give me stuff, give me stuff. That's not gonna give me a level 20. All right, we're gonna have to do it at the beginning of next episode, guys, but we have infinity, which is really nice. I don't have to carry around all these stacks of arrows. And uh, shucks, guys, shucks, that really sucks. All right, well, anyways, thank you guys for watching. As always, take it easy. And uh, I'll see you not tomorrow, but the day after tomorrow for another World SMP video. I'm going to try to keep uh, World SMP every every day, every other day. And then in the days I'm not doing World SMP, I'll try to upload Thrall games or some other mini games. So, yep. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you then. Take it easy. Peace.